My name is JT Christensen. I am a caseworker cultural mediator here at Harborview Medical Center for our Spanish speaking surgical patients, and I've worked at Harborview for the last 20 years. One of the things that I most enjoy about my job is teaching patients how to take care of themselves after surgery. Uh, this involves uh, not only teaching the patient, but also teaching their family or social, social support how to take care of them. And one of the benefits to doing this kind of work is that we are able to decrease uh, length of stay in the PACU after surgery and uh, get the patient home in a timely uh, manner. Um, if there's a question that comes up that I can't answer off of the information that I've been given, I'll text the attending and get what we need. Um, and similarly, uh, if an attending uh, <clears throat> requires my help with something, they're free to text me on my work phone or call me on my work phone as well, and we'll meet up and collaborate. Fundamental to really good clinical care of patients is good communication. The cultural mediators like JT are critical to our mission of that communication and good patient care. So part of the discharge process also involves writing and translating very clear discharge instructions for the patient and their family. And that's why uh, I try to huddle with either the residents or the attendings before the case starts in order for them to give me the instructions that I need to translate. And um, here we have our medication list all translated into Spanish. We have our discharge instructions uh, relative to the surgery itself. One of the things that's been really helpful is that JT has learned how to integrate patient instructions in their own language inside our EHR, which saves us a ton of time in discharging and also on the day of surgery for outpatients. Yeah. Ibuprofen a las 11. Entonces se puede volver a tomar a las 5 y media y a las 5. Okay. Tima tres cúbicos de líquido por día, o sea, en 24 horas. Por dos días, marquen a la clínica. Okay. ¿Sí? Okay. The cultural mediators have been really important in helping us prepare inpatients for discharge by familiarizing their families with what will be needed at home in their own language. That's really shortened our length of stay and helped expedite discharges. So the teaching that you've just observed at bedside uh, with the patient uh, took me maybe eight, ten minutes max. Uh, whereas if uh, that teaching were to be performed via, say, a telephonic interpreter, that teaching might have taken 30, 40 minutes, uh, something like this, which would extend uh, the patient's length of stay in PACU. So at the end of the day, I see approximately 550 patients through their entire surgical process at Harborview Medical Center. And I tend to sleep really well at night because I know that I've done everything possible to give every single patient that I see the best possible care here at Harborview Medical Center.